Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 7 and 8 of BNA. It's been a long freaking time since what happened <laughs> since. It feels like three months. It feels like forever. Okay, I, I barely really remember stuff from the show. All I remember officially as of right now is that Misha and Nana, um, Nazuna and Nana aren't friends. We're still wondering about the situation about Michiru. Um... Shido's just being Shido. What's your face is still, you know, Nazuna's still part of that fucking cult. And maybe that'll get a little more explained between these next two episodes. Maybe even eight. I don't know. Let's go ahead and get started with episode seven. And hold on. Um, fuck it. Go over in three, two, one, go. But honestly, this feels like... Seven months. <laughs> because the last time I watched the show, I sat here for three hours binging the first six episodes. And then Netflix decided today, well, really yesterday in Japan time, to release episodes seven to 12. And I'm like, hold on, wait, was me not supposed to come back on the 20th of May? I had time. I was going to watch my Patreon shows that I, so now I got to watch this. Um, and then my other two Patreon shows and get that done by tonight. And the plus of the fact is I'm like grinding in Persona 5 Royal to try to finish that like fucking quickly. I'm about to start the Thomas Palace soon. But sometimes it's so hard. <laughs> mm. If not, you're gonna shoot at him or some shit? Because she's been so influenced by that damn cult. That's why I still, I remember, I still want an episode that focuses on her and her ish of when she was joined the cult and all the other ish because, oh god, there's so many unanswered questions with her. Oh, I saw the picture of you before. Yeah, on YouTube. <laughs> I'm fixing the room. I mean, you made a big ass hole. Are a bird. We have senses about wind. Shit. 
you would show me food, and I haven't even eaten yet. The only thing I've eaten is fucking gum. <laughs> you can't eat gum. Yeah. Yeah, you get to go anywhere you want to. <laughs> well, you know how to meet you. You can like, you have like so many different species inside your eyes that you don't even know. Yeah, because I bet you that dude's corrupted as fuck too. Because in a way, they both have to be. We know Michu is the key to almost everything, but I feel like Nazan is still the key as well, too. There's two different keys, and they gotta come together for some weird reason. Is that that guy? I like him, but at the same time, I can't trust him. But see, that don't sound like him, though. I mean, ooh. The more I listen to his voice, I kind of hear... Yeah, that is not for me. Mm -hmm. But it's more of a Sakuta, like really, really soft. Yeah. And then if you add this cold, it will just be worse. See, that's just called for that you're still going to be doing research even though shit happened. <laughs> Jeez, oh my god. Yeah, but how did you know, like, the first time? Mm -hmm. 
part. So that's why they Oh my god, you know that since like how long now? You do what you gotta do. I swear to God, if this is the dude that we just met. It is. But why the oh my God? He's like, you can't trust fucking anyone. Yeah, because he got shit to do. Me too, if you only knew. It's going to be worse. Yeah, but then watch like something get attacked in the city tomorrow. I mean, come on, point A to point B. But me too, you can't trust everybody you just met. How that could have been a fucking story he told you. We don't know what's left from right. I mean, Jesus. He could be like Heike from Monogatsuri. He could be lying about fucking everything. Yeah, put them points together. <laughs> Please be smart. You are a smart child. You are Akko and what does it mean child?
Oh, shit. No, this isn't all white. This is wrong. Someone's got to be playing a bomb somewhere. say that Nazuna is like with the false the false bomb <laughs> bullshit like I can't this is bullshit <laughs> You say no violence, but like in my heart, there's gonna be violence. He's gonna drop that foot back somewhere. He has to be. No. You're really just gonna go in their face first? Only me to do. Only me to do. Oh my god. We're still trying to figure that out, bro. I mean, this is only episode seven. Yeah. 
Yeah, if that was the case, you had already been there. No, 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 no. Oh my god, you are so funny. I mean, she can't turn it on like a. Are you fucking kidding? I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Oh my god! Fucking Nazuna. They both the same is. It makes so much fucking sense. If freaking me too can do it, why can't Nazna? Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? You've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh my god. I don't know. What? The they had to be tested with the same ish. Something about this is not right. Because if Michiru can do it, how in the world can Nazuna do it as well? See, this false god-ish, I can't anymore. Mm -hmm. I have so many questions about this. And, I mean, that's all, like I said, that's all I fucking want. I want a backstory on Nazuna because there's so many unanswered questions on her specifically. Why don't y'all just go ahead and release the rest of the damn episodes? You probably have all the rest of the episodes, Netflix, so just go ahead. You release 7 to 12, it makes the most sense. Just go ahead and release how many of her episodes? I swear to God, if it's just 12 episodes. 12 episodes isn't enough for this story. This story feels like it's going to be like a 24 to 26. Most trigger shows are 26 episodes, so I don't expect the show to be over after episode 12, but oh my god. Because, okay, so Nazuna got tested first. She got taken away first. And so it's kind of assumed that Nazuna got tested first, but we don't know when Michiru specifically the date-wise, when Michiru went in, because we don't even know. She doesn't even know why she was there. She don't even know that she's in the freaking computer system yet, and I need her to know. Oh my god, just, there's still, like I said, there's so many fucking unanswered questions, and it's just like, oh my god, you have to remember certain things, and it makes me want to go back and rewatch the first six episodes, and then rewatch this episode, but like, oh my god. Mm, I, like, okay, I trust Alan, but then at the same time, I don't, because I feel like he has his certain things. I mean, you have, you have the mayor, you have Alan, you have the terrorist group, and then you have, um, Nazana and her cult. That's four different, well, two people, but then two organizations doing whatever the fuck that they need to do. And it feels like, because I kept thinking that the terrorist group, and the cult were going to work together in this episode. And that whatever it was going to be, we were going to see it in episode 8. But, I mean, now because it's just like the cult has their own thing. And they want to just, you know, work together with the humans. But then Alan and whatever Alan's trying to do, I don't know. I mean, it's complicated. It is so fucking complicated. Like, oh my god. Whatever it is, it, it's probably obvious, like, really, but I'm guessing maybe in episode 8 we'll get a little more clarity into it. I'm not 100% sure. We'll find out in a minute, but, like, I don't know. I mean, 
even me to do seeing her best friend again, I don't know, that could have sparked something in her. Like, okay, well, maybe, yeah, I should still trust my best friend no matter what. I'm still not trusting her ass. I mean, after the ish that she said to her in episode six and how they both just left, or really Nazana left Michiru, and Michiru went home crying. I was like, yeah, okay, fuck this bitch. Like, um, there's no way you can fix that friendship. I want them to fix their friendship because they've been so close at the hip, and they've always been with each other, whether they're ups or downs or whatever, but because of the fact that they were separated for God knows who, how, how long, and because of the fact is Nazana is corrupted by this fucking cult, and she is this false prophet trying to, you know, do what she's doing. It's just, I don't know. And then meet you doing what she's doing with you know, It's just really, really complicated. But yeah, go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode eight. Okay, episode eight in three, two, one, go. Um, Yeah, but see, that's what they want you to do. That's what they want you to think. See, Alan might be more fucked up than what's his face in Promare. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm calling that now. Like, <laughs> like, I don't know. But that dream, shit, <laughs> you got something you want to share with the rest of the class? I mean, um, we're not just going to, you know, show that and just slip right back. But I mean, that has to. Okay, how to, like, I don't think shit else, like, it did with something else, it's the, I don't know. <laughs> this is episode eight. I got no fucking clue. But, maybe, there could have been a war. He was a part of it. Whoever that was, he saw him. He didn't die. I don't know. God. <laughs> I'm probably nowhere near right. <laughs> well, at least she'll be somewhat close to mine. Yeah, I know. Keep filling some type of way. Oh, shit. No, don't go over there. Mm -mm. Because you're not really friends anymore. Probably not, but she has to be.
I'm still calling you know, I don't know. I don't feel like calling you that. So, sorry. <laughs> See, I feel like all them people who are just saying that they're going to get corrupted too. Mm hmm. She was fine and she was something. Mm And then I really don't trust him because, I mean, he's the one who's saying it's Janazana, no matter what. He's putting all this shit in her ear. What are you about to do to him? You're not gonna kill him, are you? Yeah, he's definitely gonna kill him. I mean, um, that's the McKenzie vibes right there. Huh? Tell him. Tell him! Um... What the fuck did he do to him? Cult. A cult leader, he put something in him, a drug, something, I don't know. Oh, God. Uh. Oh, me too. Oh, my God. <laughs> you can't hold him like that. Oh, damn. You just gonna dump him in the water? But then what about you?
the fuck is that green stuff though? Oh! The lies you tell, you just got stabbed! Regenerate. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Do you think he can run with- Oh. Oh. Um... <laughs> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> oh my god! I had a feeling! I had a feeling that I kept telling no! <laughs> So y'all knew about this? But you know what? It makes so much fucking sense. You know why? Episode one, he shows up twice. I don't know. <laughs> it made the most sense, and I kept thinking about that in episode one, but I kept thinking, no. Oh my god. Nothing. Exactly. We don't know shit about this man.
But how did he become? Was it because of the ish from the beginning of this episode? The human's attacked, of course. So in a way, the, ch the gods chose them. What the fuck is this? Uh. So not only the gods, but the people he's sitting to us. the general who killed his people is alive too bro what oh my god what if it's alan oh, 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 oh. if it is This only if he's had to and twist it out.
más o no. I don't know, but I got a bad phone about this because what if Nazima says some shit? It had to be whatever that green ish was. Whatever the freaking cult leader gave him is a drug. It has to be. Bruh, like, oh my god. <laughs> weird that I called this several episodes ago in one. I never said anything in the episode, but in the back of my mind, I was thinking about it, and then it comes back and I'm in the whole eight. What the fuck is this? Like, oh my god. That's what, it makes so much sense, because mm, there were times where I was sitting here, and I kept wondering if we were ever going to know anything about shit all the time. I kept sitting here wondering, why the fuck he has that color on? <laughs> Oh my god. I want to know what happened next. <laughs> I am so curious. I just, I have that feeling that when Nazan knows, she is going to take that ish and she is going to fucking run with that shit. And she's going to tell freaking Butt. And, 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 oh my god. And the, the shit that he did. Oh my god. This is just too much for two episodes. I mean, I'm literally gonna have to check me out. No, fuck it. Give me my phone now. I'm gonna check me on right now because, um, that, mm -mm, that just, oh my god, Jesus Christ. I just, I don't know what else to say about this. Like, oh my god. Every single time when I think it's gonna go one way, it goes a completely different way, but just like the fact is. Because I kept wondering so much about Shadow. Because I kept thinking, like, well, number one, how old is he? Because he looks a lot older than he looks, but then he looks the same age. This mother ever. Oh, my God. I can't. How the fuck do you call that shit? And then you're just like, no. Oh, my God. I can't. Dude. Oh, my God. What time is it? 1.23. Oh, shit. Okay. So, 9 is out. Okay. <laughs> I ain't doing this until Friday. I got Patreon shows to get done today. But, oh, my God. Just. It, it's going to get worse. Somebody else is bound to find out. I feel like Alan's going to find out because of the fact is that the mayor should oh, And now Michiru now know. No, and Michiru's going to go tell freaking Nazuna. And Nazuna's gonna run with that shit. I just, because I still don't trust Nazuna. I mean, come on, like, behind that cute little face and that fake prophet bullshit, like, come on, she's gonna take that. And she's either gonna take it and she's gonna run with it, or she's gonna respect Michiru and literally be like, yeah, I'm not gonna tell anybody. But I, I just, I can't trust her as much as Michiru is like, no, she's still my friend at the end of the day. Like, whatever I tell her, I don't think she's going to go tell the next freaking person but like no i mean 
in this world of beastmen because you're not in the world of humans. You got a human up in this city now, but because of the fact is you are a beast man as of this, the game and the way people do their things in this city is completely different than what the human world is like. It's completely different. So I feel like also... <laughs> I don't know. Maybe the humans might end up... There might be another war. I don't know. It's just so many unanswered questions. So many theories. Anything. It's just... Oh, God. But I, I really want to know what the fuck is going to happen next. I mean, since now, Nyan only really has episode 9. And I don't know what time I'm going to be done watching Monogatari. And editing-wise, I'm going to have to probably watch it Friday with Monthly Girls. Because, um... Yeah, because I don't think I'll be able to do it tomorrow. But I don't, I don't know now. I'm just, I'm so, I'm not confused, but I'm just so, I'm excited to know what the fuck is going to happen next. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode seven and eight of BNA. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will possibly um see you guys on friday friday afternoon whenever the hell i get up or whatever for maybe episodes 9 to 12 if i can get them all out if not i'll probably have them all out by sunday maybe since i don't really have anything on sunday but yeah until then i will see you guys all next time bye